Hi everybody. I'm sure you all got the news and you know that our class has been quarantined. So what that means is the health department has asked that all of us who are in this classroom every day stay home and stay away from everybody. Uh, make sure that you have your mask on even when you're at home just to make sure that if you might have the virus that you're not spreading it to anybody else that you care about. Um, we have to make sure that we all do that tonight, tomorrow, Saturday and Sunday, but then Monday we're good. You can all come back to class then. So I look forward to seeing you. Um, tomorrow we are going to log into our Google Classroom at 9 a.m. So I expect to see everybody there who is feeling all right. And let me show you how you sign into that online. So I logged into my Google and if you don't know your password, um, I sent home a whole bunch of, this is, this is a different password card, but I, I write all the kids' passwords on index cards like this, poke a hole in them, and then they'll have a keychain on them. So look for those in your backpack. Everybody took them home today. And if you need your Google password to log in at home, it'll be in there and it'll have all of your information. Um, so once you get in, you'll see this in Google Classroom. Then you, whoops, this is the wrong account again. There we go. And in here, you're gonna find Miss Hannah's classroom. So you click on that, and then just go to this link right here that's got this little video camera beside it. And your camera will start up. And there I am, that way you can see what you look like. You can mute this if you want. And then you come over here to the green button and hit join now. So once you hit join, You'll see me in there and Mr. Klein and maybe Miss Pickett, maybe Miss Annie and the rest of our students and we'll be able to share our meeting and it usually lasts about an hour. If we have any other announcements, we'll share those then too. So make sure you tune in. When you're ready to hang up, you just hit this button here and that's it. Now, if you don't have a computer at home or a way, whoops, <laughs> or a way to log in with a screen, you can call in. Our morning meetings are every weekday at 9 a.m. So as long as we have a student who's absent, we have this broadcast. So at nine, uh, hop on there and you can call this number, 1-929-251-5508. And it'll say, what's your PIN number? And then you put in the bottom number, 313-252-562 with a uh, number sign after it hashtag so make sure you write this down and you can call in if you want to practice it you can practice it tonight if you want uh, before the meeting uh, either here or online and hop in the meeting and we'll be ready to go um, so your passwords are all in there just in case and one other thing that I sent just in case was a gray cardboard folder a uh, little pocket folder that is a remote folder it's just a packet of a week's worth of what we do during our independent work and you don't need to do anything with that unless for some reason we might end up staying longer than Monday so um, you don't have to do anything with it unless you hear from me otherwise uh, just bring it back on Monday but that's just in case you know if we have any other issues where we might need to stay home any longer also inside of there is a tic-tac-toe board like we had last spring kids can make a tic-tac-toe um, and parents can just write a note and say, well, on December 11th, my child did these three activities and then send that piece of paper back to me when the kids return to school. Or you can take a picture of it each night, each weekday and send it back to me um, so that I know that they did it. And you don't have to do any of that. <laughs> it's all in the great folder, but that's a just in case folder. So if we come back to school Monday, bring that with you Monday, okay? and then we'll send it home again if we, if we have any other remote uh, learning to do. So that's it. If you have any questions or concerns, please send them to me over Remind. Um, even if it's something for Ms. McKelvey or Mr. Murphy or Mr. Ham through the Tusla kids, um, if you send me something on Remind and um, I can get that to them and get an answer for you. So I miss all of you, but I'll see you tomorrow at 9 a.m. sharp as long as you're feeling well and um, hopefully see you in person on Monday. Okay, have a good weekend.